What do you mean we've been outbitted? Oh, hey guys. Welcome back to another episode of Crazy D's Equipment. So Junior Man is out there right now on the lot getting some tractors lined up for us. But before we go out there and see what he's got put together, there's a couple things I want to talk to you about real quick. First of all, come the 17th of this month, we will be doing a live stream. And I know I'm behind. We usually do more than this in the year, but I've just been too busy. But come in on the 17th. We'll probably start about 7.30. And uh, you can come in and talk with me and Sis. And if the doc isn't sick, um, supposedly he'll he'll be in here too to uh, to answer some questions for you um, also guys um, just we're trying to get the, the uh, Teespring store cleaned out coming the first year I'm gonna wipe out everything in the store and come out with new designs so if you guys are wanting any of the tractor shirts or the shower curtains or I don't know a pair of uh, yoga pants for the wife stickers cups the uh, buy sell fix shirts all that stuff that's in the store uh, come the first of the year it's going to be gone so right now we are running a special if you go in and you type in the code capital C capital D capital E 21 uh, the doc will probably put it somewhere on the screen around here somewhere I don't know um, you guys will get 15% off that's about all I can do if I do any more than that I'm giving the stuff away for free and that's just how Teesprings work but anyways guys guys um, with those things covered and us gone over that let's go out to the lot we're going to be you know it's gets getting to be fall it's it's getting there I know it's just the first week of September but it's getting to be fall and we're getting ready to do our uh, our early fall sales so let's go out and look at some of the tractors on the lot that we got right now that junior mints picked so I can tell you about them maybe there'd be something out there you're interested in let's move out to the lot well guys, Junior Mint got quite a row of tractors laid out for us, so we'll work our way down the down the row and uh, we'll go from there and I'll let you guys know what's what's going on with each and every single one of these. So the first thing we're gonna start with here is we have a new Holland uh, 5610. Uh, I believe this is a uh, 97 or 98 model. It's got five, uh, well, it's got six, 600 hours on it now because I've been using it a little bit around the lot. Uh, the three point PTO and uh, all that on the back of the tractor have never been used. Uh, this tractor came out of uh, Texas and it, it did some really light work and that stuff has never been used on this tractor. It's got good rubber all the way around. Uh, this tractor is priced at 16,000. Um, so if you guys end up you're interested in this tractor again you can just uh, contact me and i'm going to tell you this one more tell you this right now so you contact us through either omega ag sales on facebook or the crazy d facebook page um, you will be able to f get a hold of us on these tractors so um, let's move over here to the sisters okay guys so as we move over here to the sisters uh, i got a pair of 4630s, um, one with flotation tires, um, be good mowing tractor. It's got the mirror, diesel. Um, I believe this thing is sitting at about 4,000 hours. Uh, this one here is got standard tractor tires. Again, you know, they both three point PTO, all that diesel tractors. Once again, um, this one's sitting a little over 2,000 hours. Um, this tractor is, is priced at uh, 15,500 and this one is priced at 14,500 both really good tractors so if you're needing a good mowing tractor uh, or light work tractor around the farm these would be ideal so but anyways that's these two let's move on down to the Alice's all right guys so let's talk about the Alice's on the lot so I got the 180 and you guys might recognize this 180 from uh, from the auction video um, and then another, I think it's been in another video where I thought I told you I thought we needed to replace the clutch it ended up it does not needed a clutch it just needed uh, an operator that knew how to run it um, so once Joe and me figured out what was going on uh, it ended up it didn't need some, didn't need a clutch it did need some fluid in the rear end and we got some fluid put in it and stuff but uh, this you know diesel um, 180s are a really good tractor it's got good rubber on the back 
uh, hydraulic three-point PTO, all that good stuff. This tractor is priced at 8,500 right now. Um, then we move over here to the to the 17 twins. So this uh, this 17 good running gas tractor does need a little bit of carb issues, and we will uh, get that addressed here. I'll have Junior Mint jump on that. I noticed that when they when he was lining it up, it was running a little rough, so it needs some carb carb adjusted. But otherwise, this tractor is an excellent running condition and three point pto all that works on it it does have three point on it so eh. but this tractor 4000 will buy that and then this tractor which i honestly think between all the alice d17s on the lot and there's many of them this is the best one this if i was going to buy one this is the one i would buy uh good rubber front and back um three-point PTO haul that stuff great tractor um, this one is also four thousand um, dollars both of these are gas versions I do have a protein a protein I do have a propane version on the lot um, that tractor is three thousand dollars if you're interested in it and I have two more coming so we're getting a little heavy on the d17s but let's move down to the John Deere section so down here in the John Deere section, we have the 2010 and a 1050 uh, gas tractor, diesel tractor, both good running tractors, both three point, both PTO. You guys might recognize this tractor from the video as Hoots. Uh, Hoots now has all her tin work and stuff on her. Um, she runs really good. Everything's operating on her. She is a little bummed up and a little scuff. We were able to fix a dent in the hood and some of that stuff, but um, otherwise, uh, you know, the rubber's great on the back of this tractor. But uh, this tractor here is priced at sixty-five hundred. It'd be a great mowing tractor or small utility tractor for somebody around their place. Uh, this ten fifty. Uh, three-point PTO um, all that it's got a, I believe a three-cylinder uh, Yamaha not Yamaha Yamar motor and this is one of those John Deere's that when uh, that uh, John Deere and Yamaha yeah John Deere and what well, you know guys had a little contract thing going on with each other uh, they were building tractors for John Deere but uh, this is a good little running tractor um, this tractor is priced at 5800 but I tell you what, if you were interested in this tractor, I would do 55 on it. So you can just get it again. If you guys are interested in any of this, I remind you, you can contact us through, through, um, through the uh, Omega Ag Facebook page or through the Crazy D Facebook page. And if you're one of those people who don't do Facebook, um, then I guess content, you can you go ahead and try to contact me in the comments of this video and I will, if I see them, get back with you and get, give you a direction that you can contact us. But let's move down to the only red tractor on the lot right now. Alright guys, so you've all seen the video on this one when it came in. Doc's giving it its, its check over. It didn't need anything. This thing is solid. Um, it's a 606 International. It's got good rubber on the back, got good rubber on the front, got new cylinders on the internet. I do believe International Loader. Everything on this uh, thing's ready to go. It does need a bath and we'll have Dad give it a bath here before it leaves. Or actually hopefully maybe this weekend we got to process some got a bunch of more tractors the process will be on the lot here here soon so we're getting pretty getting quite well stocked but uh this tractor is right now the only loader tractor on the lot the uh 2020 john deere would be on the lot but it has a horn uh, a uh, black hornet's nest in it and junior mint learned that the hard way he tried to start it and they didn't like that and he got stung in the rear so which is kind of funny i was laughing i mean it was quite hilarious but um this uh this one here right now is priced on the lot at um at 8500 and then we got one last little tractor for you guys that might need something for mowing all right guys so this is the last and the final tractor that we got priced on the lot right now little te fergie um 
No, guys, this is not a TE Fergie. This is a little TO20. Little TO20 Fergie. Um, this tractor runs, operates good. It's got new rubber on the front. It's got good rubber on the back. You know, you're not going to have live PTO. You're not going to have uh, live hydraulics, but it does have that. Be a great person tractor for someone who had mowing a lot of acres you know got a 10 20 acre lot that they need to mow or just want to keep the ditches mow around their place the engine had been rebuilt on this tractor not very long ago uh, there's a little bit of carb work that junior men's going to have to get done before it leaves and he we just noticed that this afternoon it ran great uh, when we did the uh, Fergie versus Fergie video and as no matter how much Angie thinks she won driving this tractor really it was a draw she's nobody actually won that one but uh, they were easily evenly matched but what do you expect when you put a TE against a TO they're exact same horsepower exact same tractor pretty much but anyhow that's a whole nother subject but this tractor's priced on the lot I got it priced right now at 2500 but you know get a hold of me we'll see what we maybe we can work out a deal if this is something you're interested in but otherwise guys that's a few of the tractors that are on the lot there are some more uh, so if you guys got any question again contact me at the two places I I uh, mentioned earlier and otherwise thank you for coming in and I will see you later on